Hello, everyone. I'm Mina, and today I'm excited to present our recent work, co-author, Designing a Human AI Collaborative Writing Dataset for Exploring Language Model Capabilities. First of all, why are we interested in language models? Because we use them every day. When you search on the internet or write an email, notice that systems are actively trying to predict what you're going to type next. These technologies are powered by language models, which predict the next word given a context. Going beyond autocomplete systems, we hear more and more anecdotes of people using language models as writing assistants. For instance, in 2018, one writer created an autocomplete system with a language model to help him write his novel. Then language models got better and better over time. And this year, another writer wrote a book with a language model in 24 hours and published it while enlisting the language model as a co-author. Now, there is a list of books officially written with language models. So, I think it is fair to say that we've seen enough evidence that language models have potential to help our writing process. However, it is difficult to understand these language model capabilities in a holistic manner for at least two reasons. First, language models have highly context-dependent capabilities. That is, depending on the types of writing, topics, and writers, a model may exhibit a varying degree of performance. Second, even if we look at one specific piece of text, it can be subjectively interpreted. There are many viable definitions of good collaboration. Some people may want creative, new ideas from the system, whereas others may want more coherent, predictable autocompletions. Based on these different goals, the assessment of the same text could vary a lot. These challenges led us to ask this question. How can we better understand language model capabilities in a holistic manner? Our approach is to curate and analyze large interaction data sets. To this end, we propose four desiderata for designing such data sets. Then, exemplifying this approach, we design a data set called co-author. Here is how we designed co-author. First, co-author covers diverse contexts, including multiple types of writing, writing prompts, and writers. Second, co-author provides various measurements for designers to analyze writing outcome, writer perception, and writer interaction in various perspectives and goals. Third, co-author preserves details of rich interaction during writing sessions. Every text insertion and deletion, as well as cursor movement, is recorded as an event at a keystroke level. Lastly, we designed co-author to be reusable and easily expendable in the future by making writing sessions modular and using GPT-3 out of the box rather than fine tuning it to a specific domain. For data collection, we used a text editor where writers can press the tab key at any time to get suggestions. For the language model, we use GPT-3 with either high or low randomness. Here are example suggestions from GPT-3 under different randomness settings. As a result, we collected rich, replayable interactions between 63 writers and GPT-3 in around 1,500 writing sessions. Now, 
we will share part of observations from our initial analysis. For more analysis and details, please read our paper. Our first analysis studied whether GPT-3 can generate fluent text in interactive settings. For grammaticality, we observed that the text written by both the writer and GPT-3 has fewer spelling and grammatical errors compared to the text written by the writer alone or GPT-3 alone. For the diversity of vocabulary, we also observe that the text written by both the writer and GPT-3 has the most diverse vocabulary. This may imply that the use of suggestions from GPT-3 helps writers expand their vocabulary. In another analysis, we looked at instances of writers taking new ideas from suggestions and reusing them in the subsequent writing by identifying named entities, such as names and locations. In creative writing, we observed that 13% of suggestions contained new named entities, among which 20% were reused by writers in subsequent writing. Lastly, we show that designers can use co-author to find preliminary evidence for formulating hypotheses under various definitions of good collaboration. For example, a designer who wants to increase writer's productivity may find that a number of factors in co-author positively correlate with the amount of text the writers in GPT-3 end up producing. Likewise, a designer who wants to increase writer's feeling of ownership may use the ownership scores in co-author to assess potential correlation between the scores and other factors, such as the proportion of text written by writers and the number of edits writers made. To summarize in this work, we identified a need for holistic understanding of language model capabilities that are highly context dependent and often subjectively interpreted. Then we argued that data sets can help designers understand such capabilities. As a case study, we curated co-author and showed that it can reveal GPT-3's capabilities under diverse contexts. Our data set and interface for replaying the writing sessions are publicly available. Thank you.